Hello guys, welcome to my channel. A few days ago, I posted my review of the assembly and the instructions of the Ender 3 3D printer. What I want to show today is the parts that you can print, that you can find on the web. I'll post the links in the video description below. So I'm going to show you the parts that you can print to kind of enhance the uh, usability of the Ender 3D printer. So let's have a look at what these parts are. In no particular order, I printed the filament guide on the left side here. There are many available, but the link I give below also provides the right-hand side bracket, which is nice because it, it hides the, the screws and it gives you a nice uh, finish. And here, again, to guide the cable, I printed the Z-axis guide here. So this will prevent wear on this expensive bracket here. So you can just reprint this if you need to. And here for the screws, I found that the top was not finished, so I printed a nice knob to put on the top. Now looking at the front, one problem also was that the ribbon cable here that you see was totally loose. So I printed these two brackets you see in black to hold the cable. And the good thing about these brackets is that they are uh, wide enough to hold the power cable in the back so you can also use the same brackets over here as you can see i printed here this big uh, anti-snag piece to go over here to prevent this cable to catch in here but it's not really catching and i find the piece a bit too big so i may design my own here i don't like this one very much and uh, finally going back to the front let me move here the bed away I printed here the fan protector to prevent small pieces of plastic to get in the fan and on the, on, the, on the board. And finally, I bought an adapter, as you can see, to go from micro SD to a regular SD card. I'm not totally happy with the installation. I was hoping to install this bracket here that is printed on the rail on the side, but then the cable would go over the ventilation over here. And the same if I run the cable under, it will go also over ventilation uh, openings at the bottom. So I'm not totally happy with this. I'm going to, uh, I may design my own bracket actually to fit somewhere over here with this fan. So we'll see uh, how that goes. So these are all the parts I printed. And again, I'm giving you the links in the video description below. So these are the parts I printed uh, so far. I hope it's going to help you. Like I said, I may design a couple more of my own, so we'll see how that goes. And if I do, I'll post a uh, follow-up uh, video. As always, if you have any questions, put them down below. I'll be happy to get back to you as soon as I can. Have a great day. Goodbye, guys.